So in combinational logic circuits, we have two more so, um, important circuits. Those are encoders and decoders. Okay. First, I will start with the decoder. What is meant by this decoder? Generally, suppose you are having one particular data and you want to convert that data into another format. So that means whatever data you have that is converted to a code, a particular code. Okay? And the, if that code is taken as input and you want to convert that back into original data, you require decoder. So decoder what they will do? Whatever coded data you have, that data will be converted into original form. Decoder. Okay? So this decoders, different types of decoders are available. So decoders will be available with 2 is to 4 decoder. That means 2 inputs will be there, 4 outputs will be there. And uh, 3 is to 8 decoder is available. And uh, 4 is to 16 decoder is available. Next, uh, if you take this as 5, 5 is to 32 decoder is available, like that. How many bits you are taking this side, inputs you are taking this side, output side, you will get 2 power of that value, 2 power of that value, okay. So, so many decoders are available here. I will start with the 2 is to 4 decoder, a simple 2 is to 4 decoder. A simple 2 is to 4 decoder consisting of 2 inputs, I am calling these inputs are A, B and 4 outputs, I am calling this as uh, uh, D naught, D1, D2, D3. Okay. So, first we will see from the block diagram, we will see what is the operation of decoder. Next, we will construct circuit for this. So, decoder it consisting of two inputs. So, that's why it consisting of four outputs. 2 power 2 equal to 4. If two inputs you have, four combinations you can apply. If two inputs you have, you can apply 0, 0 first. If you apply 0, 0, only this output line will be activated. That means, if you want, you are having four output lines. Out of four output lines, through which line you want to get your output, that you have to decide. If you apply 0, 0 here, the first value, first combination, you will get output from the D0. That means, D0 will be 1 and remaining all will be 0. Suppose, if you apply 0, 1 here, D1 will be activated. D1 will be activated and D0, D2, D3 will be deactivated. Similarly, if you apply 1, 0, D2 will be activated. If you apply 1, 1, D3 will be activated. So, that means through which output line you want to get data that will be decided by input you are applying. Okay? So, this is a simple concept of decoder. If you take the same thing in the form of a table, if you take two inputs A, B, and 4 outputs in this way, at input side you can apply 4 combinations. If 0, 0 is applied, D0 will be 1 and remaining are 0. When 0, 1 is applied, D1 will be active. 1, 0 is applied, only D2 will be active. 1, 1 is applied, D3 will be active. Okay? So, depending on a particular value, only one output line will be active, remaining will be deactive. So, this is the table of the decoder, 2 is to 4 decoder. So, now we will construct the same in the form of logic circuit. Okay? To construct this, I am using two inputs A, B. A, B values are always changing. So, that is why I am taking NOT gate. That means, I am getting A bar, B bar also. According to the table, if 0, 0 is the input, output should be D0. So, I will take 0, 0 means A bar, B means 0 means B bar. So, I will take connection from A bar and B bar, I will connect to AND gate and this output I am calling as D0. So, whenever you apply 0, 0 here, these two NOT gates will produce 1, 1, 1 into 1, 1, output is 1, D0 is 1. So, next case is 0, 1 case, that means A bar. B. A bar B. Whenever you apply 0, 1 here, 1 you will get from here, 1 you will get from here. So, corresponding D1 will be 1. 
नेक्स्ट केस इज वन जीरो वन जीरो मीन ए बी बार दिस विल बी कनेक्टेड टू डी टू एंड लास्ट केस इज वन वन केस आई विल टेक कनेक्शन फ्रॉम ए आई विल टेक कनेक्शन फ्रॉम बी दिस इज डी थ्री दिस इज डी थ्री ओके सो नाउ दिस इज द सर्क्यूट फॉर द टू इज टू फोर डी कोडर टू इनपुट्स फोर आउटपुट्स नाउ यू कैन अप्लाई एनी वैल्यू सपोज आई वॉन्ट टू वेरीफाई वैल्यू वन जीरो I applied value one zero. If I apply value one zero, D two should be active. So we will verify whether I am getting it or not. So when one zero is applied, this not get produces zero. Zero into any value is zero. And when one is applied, this line is zero. Zero into anything is zero. When one is applied, you will get one here. When zero is applied, not get will produce one. So D two will be one. In the last case, A is one, B is zero. so this is so when you apply 1 0 you are getting output from only d2 d2 similarly by applying different inputs you can get the corresponding output so decoder will decode a particular value here 1 0 is given it is decoded that that means 1 0 corresponding to d2 only similarly we can construct 3 is to 8 decoder also a 3 is to 8 decoder a 3 is to 8 decoder consisting of Three inputs and eight outputs. Okay, so here inputs I am calling A, B, C, and outputs D7, D6, D5, D4, D3, D2, D1, D0. I am taking all the outputs, eight outputs. If inputs are three, three bits, we can apply eight combinations. Triple zero to triple one, all values are applied. When triple zero is the input, the decoded value should be D not, and remaining all values zeros. For zero zero one, D one should be active, and remaining all should be deactive. When zero one zero is applied, D two should be active, and remaining all should be deactive. Similarly, for remaining cases. so if you observe here for 0 0 0 only d not is activated for 1 1 1 only d7 is activated corresponding to that number only that particular output line is activated remaining are in the deactive mode okay so this is the tabular form for 3 is to 8 decoder now we will construct the same thing in the form of circuit okay to construct circuit we require Three inputs A, B, C, and we require A bar, B bar, C bar also. Now inputs are ready. First case is zero, zero, zero. So A bar, B bar, C bar. Connect these two to and again. This is D not. Next zero, zero, one. Zero A bar B bar C D one next zero one zero one zero A bar B C bar this is D two next zero double one that means A bar B C this is D three next one double zero that means A, B bar, C bar, D four. Next one not one. A, B bar, C, D five. Next one one zero. A, B, C bar, D six. Last case A B C. so you will get 
8 outputs T0 to D7 and inputs 3 inputs A, B, C. Okay. Now, you can apply any value. I am applying 101. If I am applying 101, just look at the outputs of these AND gates. So, if, if this is 1, automatically this bar will be 0. This entire output will be 0. So, all these gates will produce output 0 except D5. Look at the D5. So, it is connected to 1. So, this is 0. So, bar, it is connected from bar B bar. So, no problem, it is 1. C is 1. So, 1, 1, 1. D5 is 1. Remaining outputs are zeros. Okay. So, this is the working of 3 is to 8 decoder. In the same way, we can construct 4 is to 16 decoder. 4 inputs, 16 outputs. Like that, we can construct decoders. Okay.